HBE95 is a two-part epoxy coating used for the protection of pipeline valves, fittings, and field joints. A detailed product installation guide identifies the important steps to properly install HBE products. HBE95 is supplied in kits containing pre-measured components of Part A HBE95 Cure, which is in the small container, and Part B HBE95 Base, which is the large container. The standard kit contains the HBE95 components, while the complete field ready kit also has a stir stick, scraper, and gloves. Both kit types include an installation guide and material safety data sheets. Clean exposed steel and adjacent pipe coating with a non-oily solvent cleanser, such as ethanol or MEK, to remove the presence of oil, grease, and other contaminants. Ensure that the pipe is at least 3 degrees Celsius above dew point before cleaning. Thoroughly clean the cutback area to near white metal, which is either the SIS SA 2.5 or SSPC SP10 cleanliness standard. Also, lightly abrade or sweep blast the line coating at at least 50 millimeters on each side of the cutback area to maximize adhesion on the coating overlaps. Wipe the surfaces clean with a lint-free cloth or air blast the steel and pipe coating to remove foreign contaminants. The surface must be clean and dry prior to application of HBE products. All components must be warmed to at least 20 degrees Celsius prior to mixing to ensure a quality blend. Pour the HBE cure container into the HBE base container and scrape the walls and lids of both containers to ensure that all of the product is used. When mixing, slow the mixer down at the surface of the liquid to prevent the introduction of air into the coating. Never add solvents or other materials to the mixture. Begin by mixing slowly and after an initial mix has been achieved, a spatula or mixing stick should be used to remove any material from the side of the container. Mix at such a speed that ensures a uniform mix but avoids creating a vortex in the liquid. At temperatures between 20 degrees and 40 degrees Celsius, mix for one minute with a drill stirrer or four minutes with a spatula, blending both parts to create one uniform color with no streaks. Use a brush, roller, or trowel to apply HBE products to the joint or patch area to a specified minimum thickness. Start by pouring material onto the pipe, followed by spreading at a uniform thickness. Overlap at least 50 millimeters onto the mainline coating. The coating should only be applied at temperatures above 10 degrees Celsius and when the ambient temperature is 3 degrees above the dew point. Of note, the pipe substrate can be preheated to 85 to 95 degrees Celsius in order to accelerate curing or to cure the product more readily in cold conditions. The ideal mixing and application temperature is between 20 and 40 degrees Celsius, and the workable pot life after mixing is approximately 15 minutes at 20 degrees Celsius. The pot life will be extended at lower temperatures and shortened at higher temperatures. Consult Canusa for special requirements as different blends of curative are available depending on ambient conditions and substrate temperatures. Using a wet film thickness gauge, check the thickness at the quarter points around the pipe and at the edges and center of the joint. After checking, Smooth over the test areas so that a holiday in the coating does not develop. Once the material has been applied, it must be allowed to cure prior to being subjected to any impact or backfilling. Cure times will vary depending on ambient conditions and surface temperatures. Consult Canusa for specific information.